Disney just did one of the most disgusting things that I have seen this company do in a very long time. This story is absolutely insane. This is coming from people who are making a very patriotic film that is going to be coming out soon called The Sound of Freedom. I'm sure some of you have heard about it, and it's something that is turning out to be a wild success, and it's going to be driving Disney's Indiana Jones 5 into the ground, and this whole thing is getting completely insane with this whole story, as it looks like it is turning into a complete butt bloodbath with Disney. So let's get into this whole thing here and see what is going on. So this is coming from Jim Caviezel, who played Jesus in the Passion of the Christ film, who claims that the upcoming film Sound of Freedom is outselling Indiana Jones in the Dial of Destiny 3 to 1, insinuates that Disney tried to shut the film down. Of course they did. When you hear why Disney tried to take down this film, it will not be a shock to you at all. It has things to do with doing terrible things to, to kids, to, uh, you know, doing all sorts of horrific things, different acts of just disgusting natures that, of course, we know many elites in Hollywood are engaged in. And so what he has to say here, Jim Caviezel, is crazy. So let's get into this here. The, the real simple version of this is Tim Ballard, Homeland Security agent, a former CIA, is taking down these big traffickers. So he's talking about what the, the film is about, basically. He finds one of the worst traffickers at our south border, one of the worst you've ever seen, Ernst Lipachinsky. They take him down and they find this little boy. The little boy turns to him and says, will you, five-year-old boy says, will you save my sister? And it burns in his heart. He doesn't know what to do other than talk to his wife and he sells everything and he goes down to find this one little kid. And that sounds like an amazing movie. I cannot wait to see what this film is about. At one point, we lost all our money because Fox got bought out by Disney. So Disney is holding the purse strings here. We lose the film. Eddie goes out and gets us five million bucks uh, to save the movie. Wow. You weren't supposed to see this. This is a movie they do not want you to see. Yeah. And that is 110% correct. Of course, this is the movie that Disney does not want you to see. And we're fastly selling out our theaters right now, and we need the people to call to get more theaters. It's like very similar to what happened on The Passion of the Christ. Yeah. We were running out of theaters, and then people were calling in and saying, hey, we, we want to buy a whole theater. Essentially, we just picked up 300 theaters yesterday. But we're out selling uh, Indiana Jones right now, three to one. But we're fastly coming up to a wall that we're we're going to run into outselling Indiana Jones 5 3 to 1. That is absolutely insane. So, obviously it has nothing to do with the money. Disney, of course, isn't really interested in promoting a film like this because it doesn't matter how much money it makes. This is the type of awareness that they do not want us to be focused on. And I think this quote of what he said in that interview uh, sums it up perfectly. You weren't supposed to see this. This is a movie they do not want you to see. And I can't wait to see this film. So let me know what you think about all of this in the comments below. Are you going to be going to see this film once it comes out. Hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll talk to you all in another video very soon.